truth. Hey guys, it's Deshi and welcome back to another game review video. So as you'll know from the thumbnail, we are actually going to be looking at Imani today. And as you'll, um, sorry, I'm, I repeat myself. And Imani received a new skin, which is called the Imani skin. And also Imani. the, if I can Imani. find it, the Genesis skin as well. The Genesis skin, you have to purchase for 800 crystals. And that's the recolor one. And that's a direct purchase. And that also goes for the Ram skin. The Ram recolor, you have to purchase do a direct purchase or 800 crystals for that as well and for this skin the default one you have to get it in a chest so if i show you here if you go to the store and go to the digital world chest you will have not only the two skins and you also have like the fury skin the knessa inara other skins as well and you have the ram skin which is right here which i'm going to be doing a review on and also the imani skin imani skin Imani Imani skin. Initial thoughts when I first saw it, it was probably my second favorite and Ram being my first. And Imani. I just want to see how good it is. Like I'm pretty Imani. excited. I've been wanting to play Imani for a few days now and I had to wait so I can try out this skin. So initial thoughts, it is wicked. It is really, really, really cool. And I really love um the the emojis on the, her, her chest piece were over there on a the chest piece i just love that it's, i didn't even notice it until now and it's also on her shoulder pads i mean not shoulder knee pads as well and i believe it's probably on the elbows nope nope no it's not it's just really cool and on her arm as well it shows um the elements so you can see the frost and then when i go into a game you'll see the fire as well loadout wise i don't know what Imani. i'm going to go for but we're just maybe focusing on the skin Imani. itself and I can't choose the... It's not going to the Imani skin. Okay, it picked. That was my fault. So, as I always do, let's hear the voice packs and also the ultimate. Oh, they're flying! Let me know if you want a rematch. <laughs> oh! I should buy some items. Yeah? Come on. Watch your heads. Ah! And then let's hear the ultimate. Ignore Ivante Dracon. I like that. Let's hear it one more time. Ignore Ivante Dracon. For some reason, I wonder who's where the voice actually is from in terms of what country she, she's from. Because I just have some speculations. So we're going to jump into a match and then we're going to give our review of the skin. All right, so we have our skin here and we have Siege, Spitzer and Corey. And again, just looking at it, it is really, I just love it. I love how it's not so complex as well. It's so simple. I love the hair. I love, I just, I, I, it's so good. It's really good. Right now, my initial thoughts are giving it a good 9 out of 10 with the voice line as well. But the effects is what matters the most. Hopefully the effects aren't so annoying in terms of hearing it. And also in general to be honest okay so this is their money skin what it looks like now let's just use this pose just to see it and they also changed the look of the emo of the radiant piece it's really nice it it's a really good skin let's change our element to fire and as you can see you have the fire right here you have the element of the fire on her arm and if i do the oh wow that is amazing that is so cool. Whoever created the skin deserve a raise. It is actually really, really cool. Love how it looks. Everything Four, about it. Three, There's nothing I hate two, about it, honestly. One. It's not so much as well as that is happening. It's simple, it's elegant. It's just very sweet. So let's look at the effects. Again, it's si similar to the Ying skin. It's not so much. It can be a bit annoying hearing the fire stars constantly, but it's not as bad. Okay, I'm a bit low in health right now, so I'm going to have to wait a bit. Oh god, I'm not even paying attention to the Yago off. I just can't wait to ult. That's one thing I'm looking forward to. Fire. 
Let's try and see if we can get the Maeve, if we can aim. There we go. Okay, I did not expect to die that quick. <laughs> yeah, the skin is actually really cool. And in terms of the effects, it's, it can be a little bit annoying, but it's not as annoying as I thought with the Ying skin. I'm not saying the Ying skin was bad at all. It was an amazing skin. They did really good on their skins there. But it can feel a bit repetitive. The Pyromania, py the Flame. The I forgot what the effect, um, the ability is called actually. But with the effects, it's nice. Let's go up here. The one thing I would say that could have been improved could have been the 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 glide because it's just a flat 2D shape. And it can be a bit bland. But apart from that, it's not bad. Let's actually look at the... What's it called? The frost bolt. Oh, it's, you can see the little emoji on it. That is actually so cool. And here is the flame lance. What's it called again? It's called the frost bolt or pyro ball. No, wrong one. Inferno cannon, that's it. I don't know what I got the name from. Do you love the skin? In 15 seconds. Would I give it my first 10 out of 10? Yeah, I give it my first 10 out of 10. I have nothing, actually, no, lie. Because I don't really like the effects as much. I'll give five, it a 9.5 out of 10. Four, three, the skin is amazing. Two, well, let's actually hear some of the voice lines. Hey. Oh, good luck with that. Let's have some fun. It's not, oh, I have a little lag there. Thanks, Healer. Inferno Cannon. Wait, why did she say Inferno Cannon when I put my Frost Bolt? Odd. Yeah, I don't know why she said Inferno Cannon when I did my... Uh, my Frost Bolt. I wonder if she says Frost Bolt when I'm doing um, my Inferno Cannon then. The Pyro Balls look so good. That's a, that was a nice little line there. Because if you guys know game really well, in hardcore mode, if you die, you die forever. Just in case you guys didn't know. I have a, I highly doubt someone wouldn't know that. But just in case. Oh, I love the effects. It has some really nice effects. Really nice effects there. I love the dragon. It really looks so different to your archetypal, type of archetypical dragon. Some of the effects aren't bad at all. They're really nice. And they're not overdone as well. I feel like it's more about playing the match now rather than actually giving a skin review. Oh, I tried to get the Maeve and I got the Charlene instead. The one time I want my aim to be a bit obscured. <laughs> Great heels. How did I not hit? I'm pretty sure I did hit him there. Let's go and put that down there and it missed. I'm just going to farm off the Yagaroth. Thank you. There we go. Nothing to... I have nothing... I have nothing negative to say about the skin. It's... Wicked. I wish I could find something wrong with it. The effects are just a bit annoying. Because... This little... That little... Wind up I must say. I love the look of the Pyroball before you throw it. It's kind of giving you some Minecraft vibes, as if like Minecraft and Paladins banded it together seconds. to make the effects. Hurry 
There we go. And we finish off with a good ult. That was... The skin is amazing. It's actually a lot better than I thought it would be. I know I've seen the live show already and I know what the skin was going to be like, but seeing it first person in my perspective, it's a lot better than I anticipated. And I'll definitely give props to Hi-Res, or whoever, actually, as a matter of fact, whoever designed the skin, definitely give props for them, whoever made the effects. They did a really good job. So we're going to go for another game and we'll see how well we can do. And from the stats here, I did pretty well, I can't lie. Well done to me <laughs> and the team. The team did amazing as well, especially the Corvus. But yeah, let's jump into game two and hopefully we'll be able to give a review on the second skin. All right, so let's hope that it actually does work this time. So you're going to do our booster here and we're going to go for a team booster. So everyone can get a nice skin of their choice. Everyone got happy there. And we're going to go for the Genesis one. Oh, did you not see the dragon? That, wow, I love the pink dragon. That looks good. It's called Genesis um, Dragon dot Raw, which is cool as well. It looks good. And looking at the skin, it's pretty wicked. But I'm not sure how the effects are going to work for this one, because as you all know, it's purple. And obviously, ice is not purple. So I want to see how this one's going to look. And we have 105 um, Terminus. Yay for us then. <laughs> Hit him with the fire. Hiya! Then hit him with the iceberg. What kind of intro was that? <laughs> I have no clue what the intro was, but that was hilarious. But okay, so as you all know, this is what she looks like. I do love the like pink and purple that they're having going on here. Get over the small doors right now. And with the effects, okay, I see. Oh, oh, okay. Okay. They didn't disappoint me there. That looks nice. I love the purple and yellow. That's given up. That is really, really good. Five, four, that is amazing. Three, two, I know I'm probably one. overreacting, but I really love the look of it. I love the colors. It looks extremely good. It looks a lot better than I thought it would have. Okay, sadly you can aim. This skin is actually fire. Literally. There we go. At least I can aim there. Oh! Almost died there. I'm not sure that's going to hit anyone. Oh! I don't know what I hit. Oh, damn. Almost f I fed into his shield and his reversal. But yeah, I love the colour. I love how it goes like a Enemy yellow color. It's kind of like a dyed orange, essentially. Ooh! Thank God I reacted fast enough to that. No, I'm sorry. I can't aim. <laughs> I, can't really, I really can't aim. Okay, at least I got rid of the Androxys there. Yeah, but with the skin, I love how they didn't... But with the blue, it stays purple, as you noticed. It's keeping a purple element. That's why I was a bit skeptical of it. Because once I change to um, Frost, everything goes back to default. So you have the purple pixels, the purple hair. And I was like, probably not. But once you change and you go back on it, it goes to yellow Five, and that's four, amazing three two at least you one. know what like stance you're on rather than looking at your abilities even though you should know of course but it's just a really cool little feature That should have helped a bit, but I'm sadly stuck. There we go. Oh, let me get some core rise. That's one thing I forgot to get. And some haven. Oh, 
Okay. They gain so much heals. I don't know what's healing them. But Ying is going for damage, so I'm wondering what's healing them so much. Oh. I don't know how I was able to hit him with his reversal up. I'll take that then. <laughs> and I don't know how I managed to flick that. And I can't attack no more. Okay, there we go. Maybe that was my little bit of karma there for hitting him with his reversal up. Oh wait, look. That is actually so cool. I didn't even realize that. And look at that. Oh wow. That is amazing. I, I just found that out right now. Oh wait a minute. I know that person. I have to realize I'm against Pyrick, who's a really good generals player. I'm not sure if he's going to see this video, but hello. <laughs> I just I just saw it right now when I killed him. But to be honest, thanks for his streak. I was on the wrong stand. I thought I was on Fossball. <laughs> okay. I'm not sure if it's safe to ult. I'm gonna wait for the right time. I feel like he's now after me. I have to be really careful because I'm getting my head hunted. That's why this became a skin from a skin review to a very critical gameplay. In a matter of seconds. I don't know how's that possible. <laughs> And there we go, we finally won at the end. But that was intense. <laughs> My overall rating for the skin, I feel like I'll keep her 9.5 out of 10. The, what's it called, the second skin, flawless. I must prefer the purple one over the blue one, I must say, because of the color. So I'm definitely gonna invest some money into that. <laughs> Don't mind me. And stat wise, I, put, I did poor. <laughs> I've been dying a lot. And that's mainly because of the Androxis. The Androxis was so annoying. But yeah, that was that's it. that's the end of today's video. Hopefully, you guys have all enjoyed. Um, do let me know what you think about the new Imani skin, if you like it or not. And yeah, have a lovely day, everyone, and I'll see you guys all next time. Bye bye.